What's up, everyone? Anthony Gregos here with IGN.com, along with Stuart Platt, producer at Microsoft, here to show you the XPLA version of Minecraft. Um, so, Stuart, uh, what can you just like? What is your initial th thoughts and what you can tell us about Minecraft here to start? Yeah, I mean, this is very exciting. You know, Minecon here. This is the very first time this is being shown um, to the public. And you know, I think um, at this point right now, we're really here to just celebrate the fact that Minecraft has come into the Xbox 360. And so what we're primarily focusing on at this event is the, um, the crafting interface. And there's been a lot of questions surrounding yeah. how that will translate from the PC to a console. I mean, obviously, a mouse is very fast. And you're, you're li it, I don't want to say limited, but you know the, the, the control sticks present their own challenges. So yeah, it is interesting. How are you guys tackling? Uh, you know, bringing the PC controls over to a, a controller. Yeah, I mean, so, you know, first of all, just for navigation, you know, we, we wanted to have the, um, you know, the familiarity of a first-person shooter. Um, so for anyone who's played a first-person shooter, they're going to feel right at home. We have, you know, the left analog stick walking around, the right analog stick is look. And then, you know, obviously button configurations are not finalized, but we've mapped, you know, most of the common actions that we think, you know, are, are going to be, you know, mostly used to the X, um, A, B, and Y button. So in uh, Minecraft on XPLA, you obviously have the typical inventory menu, and then you also have, uh, and with this you can drag and drop, but then you can also quickly switch the items yeah, back so, and forth between. Yeah, so what we've done here is, you know, a lot of um, you know Minecraft fans will notice one of the key differences here is there's actually no crafting table here. There's no two by two crafting table. So to take inventory here, what what you're seeing is, um, you know, just like on the PC, you can use a, your your cursor, which is controlled by the analog stick, to move an item from the hot bar to your inventory. And then there's a quick move feature. So what that is is, you know, right now it's the Y button, and you can just pretty much click on one item from your hotbar, and it'll switch it out to the to your um, inventory. And then uh, once you place a crafting table, then you know you can actually go into a, a quick crafting menu to kind of tackle the fact that exactly. it would it would become tedious to build otherwise. Exactly. So now what we what you're seeing here is the um, actual crafting table interface. So you'll see you've got your three by three crafting table. So you know what we wanted to do is again we want to we wanted to simplify it. Um, you know there's, obviously there's some key differences on a console like you know the keyboard and mouse you don't have as much range. And as well, just even the simple things, like you know, you, you don't really have a browser handy to go and look up on a wiki or, or whatnot. And so um, what you can do is you can, you can see all the different menus right there. So if, if you have enough materials to build something, they'll be, they'll be um, highlighted that you can build them. And, and if, if it's you don't red, have enough, then you know. If it's red, for example, there, um, you know, he doesn't have enough uh, wood planks to make a sword. Um, but there he had enough wood to make sticks. He's got enough you know, to make a wooden sword. And so, um, so you're able to just quickly click on that, and, and it's kind of it's cool because as you scroll through, you can just see all the different recipes. That again, like kind of you know they're that was you know they, they're kind of hidden in, in the PC version. You have to learn that. Yeah, I was gonna say in this one, it seems like a player could then look even to things that he obviously can't make yet, but be like, oh okay, I need to go and make sure I collect X amount of this. Exactly. You know, they can set goals for themselves in a way that maybe isn't necessarily obvious on the PC version. Exactly, that, that's exactly it. So we, again, we didn't, you know, I mean, we don't want to oversimplify it, but again, sure. just to bring it to XBLA, you know, to the console, you know, we just wanted to make it feel like a really smooth transition. And, you know, we've worked really closely with 4J Studios, who are doing the actual port, who are doing a fantastic job. And then obviously with Mojang, we, we went through some iterations and, and, you know, so far we're really pleased with that. And that's kind of the, the primary focus of what we're, what we're showing here. And then are the, basically like the mouse clicks, are they just uh, put on the, the alternating triggers now? It's like a right click to actually swing, you know, and if you yeah. were like holding a block, a right click would throw it down a left. Exactly. So yes, so that's exactly at the right, the triggers are what's basically the mouse. So he's using the right trigger right now to dig and then the uh, left triggers to throw down a block or a crafting table. Well, it's looking pretty cool. For more on Minecraft for XBLA, keep it locked to IGN.com.